cardigan. I have been wanting to make this awesome cardigan pattern from Leif Svansus for a long time. I just want to make sure that I pronounce her name right. Um, I love her pattern. She has awesome, awesome designs and um, I just think it's so cool because she does the Dutch version and the English version and it's just, she's just super, super talented. So I've had this on my list for so long and it just took me forever to find the yarn that I wanted to use and I don't know, it just took me forever to make. But I'm super excited because now I can post it on the blog and also show it to you guys. So this is officially my first Tunisia crochet project and I have to say that I am definitely obsessed. I'll be doing more projects. If you've been waiting to try Tunisia crochet, I definitely recommend it. It is so easy, so much easier than you think, for real, I promise. Um, I definitely recommend this pattern because it is so easy to follow and it is just, it just creates the coolest texture and drape. I mean, the drape is just so beautiful. I used Must Be Merino from Hobby Lobby in Russ, I think turquoise. I need to double check that. And then I added in some crochet thread because I just thought that'd be kind of fun because I always have to add in some kind of an embellishment. Um, but I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So if you've been waiting to try Tunisia crochet, go for it because it is super fun. It's always fun to learn new techniques. And I mean, the result, y'all, seriously. So go for it. going to do a 360 for you guys. This is so pretty. I also think the seaming is just so pretty with Tunisian. But the texture it is just so awesome. So I'm gonna do a full blog post about the cardigan. Um, I'll link the cardigan from Seuss. I highly, highly recommend it. It is so, so cute. And I'll link the yarn that I use so that you can go directly to that if you want to. Buddy. 